There's got to be an easier way. Welcome to this episode of DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, I wanted to do a short little video. I was watching YouTube last night, and I saw somebody just wailing on their bed to get a part off. And, and really, I've been doing this for a long, long time now, this, this method to take parts off, and I just assumed everyone knew about it, but uh, apparently not when I watch somebody wailing on their bed. So typically what you do is you get one of these spatula things to, to take the part off, and, and you know it, it doesn't do a very good job of getting the part off. So what I do is I see a lot of people take hammers and other things like that and sort of wail on the part to get it off which really damages this bed uh, now the way that I do it is, is a little bit different so in depending on the part size now this is a rather small part but I since I had it I figured it'd be a good example piece so what I use is one of these razor scrapers now you know be very careful this this is sharp obviously this is a razor uh, and, and I use a little bit better one that has rubber grips so it's good and easy to hold and then also you want to use safety glasses when doing this now I'm wearing a set of polycarbonate um, glasses I need glasses to see so it kind of does double duty um, but with this you know because what will happen is and I've had this happen is this razor blade will get caught underneath there break and go flying so it is a serious hazard but what I simply do is what I, I just kinda take it down and press down on this a little bit and usually I gotta kinda hold my thumb here to keep this locked in and then what will happen is this this will lift up this brim which then that comes off pretty easy and then what I do is I just start working working it under the piece now this is a fairly easy piece now a lot of times what I'll do is once I break this free with the, with the with the razor I'll take the, the bigger spatula and come in underneath it and remove it from the bed and you don't tear up the bed with you know coming in at too great of an angle or that uh, you know, but again, the real key here is is to flex this razor blade down. So again, you're not coming at it at an angle like this where it's digging into the bed because it can. You need to flex it and, and bring it up underneath. And again, that's one of the reasons for the safety glasses. So, I mean, you pick these up at your hardware store. And again, I suggest the more expensive ones. I've used the cheaper ones. Your hand can slip and everything. I like the rubber, so this works out really good. I'll put a link to this down below. So if you want to get one off Amazon or what have you at the hardware store, that's great. So anyways, hopefully you found value in this. Hopefully you'll stop tearing up your beds. Um and have an easier way to get your parts off of them. And if you found this interesting and valuable, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget the bell button's coming up. Subscribe and swag shops in the corner. We'll see you guys in the next video where we do something else cool. Cheers. Please click like below and subscribe to the channel to keep up to date on more.